Well, you've heard of goat yoga and kitten yoga. Well, I hope you've heard of those. I, I mean, I have. Okay, yes. good. Now a local ranch <laughs> is holding alpaca yoga classes. Yeah, uh, Markham Hill Ranch, home to dozens of alpacas that wander around during the yoga classes. Cor Harlan, live in Malala this morning, meeting some of his new furry friends. Cor, this is this is your right up your alley here. Oh yeah, you can tell that, can't you? Everything's supposed to be off the ground, just about everything here, but nothing is really getting off the ground. Isn't that awful? This is the greatest class, though. All right, enough of this. We are at Alpaca's Markham Hill Ranch this morning. The yoga class is underway here at about 5.30. This is Jennifer Cameron holding... Double stuff. I switched animals this on double you. Double stuff. This is a little <laughs> yeah. more low-key animal yes. here, right? Alpacas. Yeah. On the, they don't like their head scratched either. No, I guess, they don't. Huh? Well, these are beautiful. This is a yoga class that you typically do uh, mm -hmm. at night, not so much in the morning. But this right. is such a beautiful morning activity. Isn't it really nice? Oh my God! The this sun comes up a little bit, yeah. and for a change, it's cool. How did you all get into the business of doing mixing alpacas and yoga? First of all. Wow. Um, when you clean the barn a lot, you have a lot of downtime and quiet time to think about outside the box. <laughs> and so this is part of it. This yeah, we just thought, you know, they're such a quiet animal. Why not do something and allow people to enjoy what we enjoy? Oh, yeah. yeah. And Markham Hill Ranch is, if you're not familiar with it, it's about five miles south of Malala on Highway 2, 213 out 213. here, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah, and yeah. you do these classes how many every days a week? Every Tuesday evening from 7 to 9, but really the class is 7 to 8, and then you feed them afterwards. All right. Carl, come here a sec, because let's, let's look in on the class. We, we got a little late start this morning, so I've been doing some of the class. I'm a little winded here, but uh, uh, there's a woman up there whose name is Mirabai mm -hmm. Miller. Correct. She has been doing this for? Uh, she's been teaching for us this year, just this summer, but she's been teaching yoga for six years. Yeah, she's from Silverton. Uh -huh. so, Silverton yeah. so she comes up here a little bit. And as you can see, everybody's got their mat. Everybody's got a little piece of slice of heaven out here under the sunshine and the farm and the grass. And the classes are not so difficult that they're out of reach for a lot of people. That's what I, I mean, that's what a guy like a me likes about so long, that. So yeah, a child could be here. Uh huh. So long as they stay on their mat. Right. <laughs> <laughs> and, and the thing about the alpacas is, now they're a little skittish. Yes. They're not terribly people friendly, but they'll wander in and out of the, uh, out, in and out of the crowd oh, yeah. here a little bit Do you too, want to hold right? Them? Yeah, sure. If you don't <laughs> there you <run> go. <laughs> What's the key to holding all these guys? Just they're, right just, they're just he's pretty. Fine. Yeah, he's a pretty cool, dude. He's a cool. And they've been shaved a little bit, so they're we not. Did. They're pretty good in the heat. We share them then... one time a year. Yeah, luckily we got them shared before okay. the last heat. Well, uh, and and the nights that you do this are Tuesdays. Tuesdays. So yep. get a hold of them here. Alpacas at Markham Hill Ranch. Let's yep. take this guy for a walk through you the crowd. You can take him through. Come on, let's go through the crowd here. So all right. Well, there you go. Pete, place your feet with hips. Arms by your side, palms All right, here it is. I mean, come on. What else? You, my parts didn't get off the ground either. I'll tell you that right now. So don't anybody feel bad. Alpacas at Markham Hill Ranch is where we are this morning with uh, guys and gals like this. A little bit of yoga going on here this morning. A sunshine that is not blistering hot for a change. I was actually cool and chilly out here about an hour ago. So it is cool and quiet yoga relaxing. My big toe is tired of digging into the ground and trying to get my large exterior, posterior off the ground. <laughs> but as I can see here, a lot of people are doing a pretty good job, Jenny and Ken. This is not a bad thing and not a bad place to be for this early in the morning. He I'll, probably needs to do some yoga. <laughs> he probably needs to do it. He looks pretty good to me. He's pretty sturdy. Pretty sturdy yeah. guy. Yeah. Alpacas at Markham Hill Ranch. Yep. I think Cora was like an alpaca herder in her previous life, like a goat a alpaca boy. person. Mm -hmm. Right, Cora? A whisperer. A whisperer. A whisperer. Is he an alpaca He's whisperer. A whisperer. Okay. Mm -hmm. All right. Okay. Yeah, I, I, I kind of like his uh, yoga voice. Yeah. It's very soothing and it calming. Is. I it's guess. a good comment. When yeah. it first started, I was like, is he like... Christian Bale doing Batman, <laughs> but doing alpaca That's a yoga. Yeah. yeah. So I don't know. All right. It's interesting. All right. Cool we should send him to some more yoga classes and get that Zen going. Is that what we need to do? Okay. Well, maybe. <laughs> uh, let's take a look at our traffic and weather right now. I'll uh, we'll get to weather in a moment, but first, traffic-wise, anything happening out there, Carly? Just some police activity on the Fremont Bridge right now. So 